And we're back with another episode of Let's Play Lost Odyssey. I'm your host, the RPG Guy, and we are escaping from the clutches and magical reach of Gongora. As he is just literally nuking the entire world with different magic stuff. Monsters even here. Especially here. Look, kind of the wall's freezing over. It's dangerous to stay in that cold for too long. You leave us no choice. We'll have to fight it. So, yeah, we've got a bit of a running situation. Don't overdo it. it! Means we need to kill this thing fast, quick, fast, and in a hurry. Means we need to take this dude on the usual trips to Murder Town. Let's go with Flara. And we'll go with Dynamite. Mm -mm -mm. Toasty. Oh, my stars and garters. And Kaim learns level 2 composite magic. Let's go. I'm worried about those children. So if we stand in the ice, we actually take damage. So as you take damage in the ice, if, it, if you run out of HP, uh, you die. Hopefully that makes sense. Let's go with Sorcerer's Earrings. That'll take probably the longest amount of time. Running, 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 running. There are missable items here as well. I'm going to try to collect as many as possible. There we go. That being probably easily the most important of all of it. Trust me, it's still creeping up on us. I just gotta take my word for it, bra. Let's take it out. I still think I missed something. But I think no, I think we're good actually. Again, same setup. Time to die. Oh, it didn't die. Left these force instead. I think it's got no weakness to elemental stuff, to be fair. It's just that cold. Come on, you bastard. Easily concealed unless there was nothing to hide. 
or greatly. No reason to conceal what's back there if there wasn't something worth hiding back there, to be fair. Door. Luckily for us, that I think is the last of the big treasures. Alright, so we're going to get a number here. Third number is four. Nine which is the first number. Two. Zero. Fair enough. And we even have the order of the numbers, so it's nine, two, four, zero. Look at sweet go. Did that show up? Ice, ice burners, icers. Instead of spiders, I don't know. <laughs> We're gonna kill them like the rest. Kill them like the rest. No fire, fair, Flaris will do the job. Let's go Flaris just to make sure we get the kill. Free form of Sarah learns level five black white magic. Sweet. Cook? Mac. It's all right. It's me, Sarah. Kine's here too. Come out, you two. It's safe. <laughs> it's all right. Sarah, it's all right I'm sorry. now. I'm sorry. I just wanted to see Mom. I know, sweetheart. I know. I miss her. So do I. <laughs> Had us worried. And now we can die together. I know this sounds strange, but did stopping the train ever come to thought, or maybe running along with the train? Was I don't think physics works that way. Never mind. <laughs> ice, ice, baby. Woo. First we get frozen, then we get the shocker.
We love you so very much. Well, that's one way to destroy a giant floating magic disc of doom. But is that truly the end? Is it truly the end? <laughs> the Central Station Square. Hey, we're back in Ura. Huh? We're in Ura. So even Gongora didn't have the guards. The thing really takes it out of you. Hold it. You there? Halt! <laughs> We're at the site where the magic energy was detected. Two people found a man and a woman. We'll proceed with check. Raise your arms and turn around. What? How dare you be so insolent to your king? You're the one who's being insolent. Do as you're told. You better do as he says. I will not! I am Tolton, 45th King of Ura. How dare you point your swords at me? To think a person could lose it to the point of impersonating our fallen liege. Fallen? How dare you? I am Tolton, your king. You shallow thing. Silent fool. What? Something's not right here. You're under arrest. Come quietly and don't give us any trouble. Come along. Bad doggo. Bad. Okay, we actually are in control, and Tolton is in our party. Strangely enough, he's only level 25. But he's pretty well geared up. Um, we are fighting organic enemies. There's not really much of a reason to put too much on him, except maybe critical defense boost. So, yeah, just to keep him protected... The other thing, too, is since Seth can't learn anything, we can actually learn things from Tolton. But if that's the case, maybe it means something else. Um, but first and foremost, um, most of this stuff, though good, we will just go with some easy ones. Pick up anything easy, really. And get to work. On what? On murder! And that is correct. Tolton is with us. So we gotta deal with these infantry. Gross doggo. It's an in, in, inception doggo. Better brace yourself. Okay, that wasn't as effective as I was hoping. So let's not screw around, shall we? Yeah. As you can see, Tol Tolton is not as capable. Never underestimate the royal house. Which means we'll have to deal with him accordingly. Seth learns anti-freeze. Yay! 
I mean, in other words, we're going to have to he keep him healed up and mostly well protected. Hmm. Not too shabby. I didn't think you could handle yourself so well. Gongora betrayed me. He was using you all along. Consider yourself lucky to be alive. What are you standing around for? Come on. Me? You're a wanted man in these parts. Standing around like that's gonna get you killed. You're helping me? It's up to you. It's true. Do you want to live? Let's go ahead and heal him. And just because we'll put we'll we'll, we'll, uh, we'll restore his mana too. Against my better judgment. Um <clears throat> She was working on that at some point. But to be fair, we could learn that later. Let's grab that instead. And let's move. Okay. Um. <laughs> I heard there's going to be a sacrifice. Ceremony today. We're gonna burn a bunch of criminals alive. That pirate said is supposed to be one of them. Ooh, this I gotta see. Well, that's not good. Did you say said? Yeah, I did. Hey, what's your problem? Who cares? They're all criminals. It'll make the world a better place. What? <laughs> He's just like choking his chicken. Hold it. We can't go starting trouble. Why are you so agitated all of a sudden? I've got to save you. What? You're drawing too much attention. We'll stick to the back alleys. Yep, 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 yep. To the back alleys we go. Place this team with soldiers soon. We better get going before they catch us. Go where? Where can we go? Where do you think? Gungor's inauguration, obviously. But that's going to be held at the Royal Palace. We can't get there from here. These kinds of secret corridors are actually a lot more convenient than the normal roads. Come on, you'll get left behind if you don't hurry up. Alright. Let me think here. I know there's a bunch of little items and whatnot. Gotta get used to seeing these again. <laughs> Alright. Go this way. You. Sweet. And we'll get us another one of these. This sweet. I don't know if there's anything further down. Nope. Let's keep moving. Hey, there they are. You must be the imposter pretending to be the light king. You know, you would think that people who were from a country would know, like, a secret question or something. Maybe. I don't know. You want a piece guards. Of I don't know. Well, maybe, you know, they were informed that there's a faker or something. Who knows? Because technically, Gongora still has got the lens inside uh, Tolton, so maybe that's really part of it. Let's try to get rid of this dog first. Because I think he hits the hardest. Yeah. 
and Tolton can one shot regular guards. And another one bites the dust. So like most uh, mortal characters, they their their abilities are pretty much mastered by the time they hit level 50-ish. So there's actually many skills Tolton can teach the immortals. So making sure that we are aware and that we're actively making sure we're trying to learn stuff from them is going to be good. All right. Free healing. If it's a fight you want, you got well, now we're gonna start getting random battles. Which is fun. Time to die, doggy. Battle is one. Little by little. And that's level 28. And Tolton learned a member hit. Sweet. It means it's a low blow, right to the nuts. Um. Nice. He free healing, which means I really didn't need to use that healing item from earlier. But to be safe, it always makes sense to invest a little bit extra when in doubt. Sweet. Checking the posters there just to make sure, but I don't see anything. see it from here there's an item machine thingy kitty sweet come on there we go That structure. All right. Um, so we got some goodies. See it from back here, so boom. Get that, and I see the other little thing right there, too. Sweet. Sweet. Because moving forward, we'll just continue going further, deeper into the dungeon area, alleyway, whatever. You can see it flapping from here. What's flapping? This is flapping. Nice. Nice. 
Up the ladder we go. And away we go. We are high above Ura. <laughs> Come this way. So, let me see here. Grab this. Nice. Good. If you're really in need of some kind of items, for whatever reason, buy some, but there's nothing worth it here. If I'm not mistaken, it's the same inventory the same uh, inventory as the beginning of the game, so no point really in investing. Well, you know what? Hold on one second. Just to be fair, th there is a ring maker there. I just want to see how we're doing with our ring conversion stuff. I think we're doing okay, but I just want to check. You really can't make any of these. They're a bit far out, too. So... Yeah. Okay. Just wanted to see what if we were even close to making any of that. And I guarantee you just from the basic look, we're not. And we haven't really been making interim rings yet that are needed to make those rings. So I'm getting well, probably way ahead of myself. Way ahead of myself. Oh, Lord Torton, Tolton, you're still alive. And you are... I was one of the humble servants of Ziffa, our previous king. I doubt you remember it by this point, but I was honored to meet you several times as well, Your Majesty. There were plans already afoot in town for a royal succession ceremony. What is the meaning of your presence here? To make a long story short, we need to stay undercover or the king's life will be in danger. Can you pretend you never saw us here? Oh my goodness, what a pitiful state of affairs for the rightful king of Ura. Well, I understand. My loyalties are unwavering to the very end. You wear your majesty of the Urin royal seals. They may aid you if you are being pursued. The royal seals are Urin property dotted across the world, and only the Urin royal may open them. I believe there is one located somewhere inside the city. They say the seal's power will reveal itself to those worthy of the throne. It certainly seems you are in a position to require that power. To acquire that power? Require that power? Is that a typo? In that case, allow me to give you this. I hope it proves useful, Your Majesty. And we get a talisman. The royal seals are those things that I mentioned. We saw one in the ice area. Yeah. I like that. Um, there's one in this town, of course. There was one in the Crimson Forest, as examples. Those are... The things that we are looking for. Alright, let's head down and around. Again, there's a save point if we need to. Welcome, I'd like to wish you a pleasant stay, but I'm afraid that I may be a tad difficult. Some soldiers were in here earlier looking for you. Don't worry, though. We would never allow our guests to come in danger on our watch. I have asked the chef to open the back door for you. It'll be much safer. and It'll be safer entering and exiting that way. Now then, please come in. I understand the chef has a special menu prepared for you. Yes, the chef is the man in the hallway. He's often mistaken for a doddering old man, but his skills in the kitchen are impeccable. In any case, please enjoy your stay with us. 
We'll be completely safe here. Just be sure not to use the front exit. It could be rather dangerous. Again, we'll make another save. Again, saving is always your friend. Even though this one doesn't heal, but we should be fine from earlier. Mostly for this item, another seed. Woohoo! And here comes an annoying area to navigate. Oh boy. <coughs> but I'm gonna do my best. Hopefully, not get lost. Okay. Again, any battles that we fight usually are pretty good because it'll help Tolton level up, as far as I'm concerned. Seth learns a ward medal, which is great. We can put that on her. We're not going to put it on her, but we can have her learn something else from Tolton. May as well. Um, Lullaby is pretty useless. Um, I'm trying to become stronger. I mean, most of these are relatively pointless. So, Tolton's stuff gets better much later in the game. Um... Just currently what he's got is all that's really going to be available. Let me think. Uh, nice. stuff as I say while it loads 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 we'll get some kilo helmets and that's all that was here so we'll head back right after this murder these murderous messages <laughs> Um, 
Now I actually think I will do cut down. No, you know what? It never seems to work the way I want it to. Just need to keep our eye on Tolton. Ooh. Oh, ho, ho. Yeah, go after Seth, please. No, don't go after Seth. Well, that just happened. Oh, Tolton's down. That's a game over. And this is why you save. We're not, I don't think, supposed to be here yet. That's an impossible fight. I forget about that. Oh my goodness, how embarrassing. Yes, retry from the last checkpoint, please. So yeah. Don't want to get in a fight there. Don't want to do it. I mean, if we get in a fight there, the only thing I would suggest is to team up. Kill, like, combine power, kill that thing. Kill him one at a time, but... With the fact that you can just be hit by every, like, those status effects alone is pretty rough. And I'll be fair, I don't remember ever fighting the, those things at this point of the game. So, yeah. We will be very careful... As we try this one more time. Let's make sure we grab everything here. And you know what? You know what we'll do? Um, skill wise, they didn't think of this earlier. There's turn tail. There we go. So if we get in a fight with them anyway, we're guaranteed to safety. As far as I'm concerned, wait, we did grab this, right? Okay. Makes you question the validity of grabbing that chest, doesn't it? Well, that's what I get for not having been prepared for that. I was hoping that, that wouldn't, something like that wouldn't happen. I don't even... I, to be fair, I don't even remember fighting enemies at that area. Which is probably why I didn't mind... Didn't think to put anything on. But now that we know... We'll deal with it accordingly. Sorry to make you guys sit through this again. So that was our first game over, wasn't it? Maybe our second? So yeah, like I said, being overpowered like with Seth did not help us there. Because she couldn't handle it. She wouldn't have survived anyway. They were doing around 600 damage a round, even if we could prevent the status effects. It's too much damage. This is straight up too much damage. So the only way we would lose that battle is if they got an initiative on us, so... Hopefully we don't run into that problem this time around. I didn't think those types of enemies spawned there. Would have never thought that. Never. See? Didn't happen that time. But we're gonna leave Turn Tail on Seth just to be safe. Let me think here. Uh, not there. There. As you can see, we can get some free goodies.
It's not much of a puzzle, to be fair. But I think it's there to intimidate players from getting it. I know that sounds weird, but it's just... Some people see puzzles in RPG, JRPG games and just clam up and don't want to do them. So they'll just, if given the option, they'll just walk right by him and be like, I don't need no treasure. Here. Do that one. And the running gag is we're going to do this again. See that item down there? I'm gonna to try to get it. I believe it's uh, it's either a piece of gear, like an accessory, or, or it's a consumable. One of the two. and Seth learns a ward medal, of course, because that was what it was before. The shenanigans went down. <coughs> I think I was going to put on Lullaby just to get it learned and over with. There it is. That's what I'm looking for. It means to get to the bottom of this area. wasn't the shiny thing we saw. Oh. Oh, I'm getting things confused here. I know what I'm doing. All right. I think I know what I'm doing. Let's get back across. Okay. Now. down. So I want to say Okay, let's try this now. Cuz this has the elevated platform. That brings the shiny to us. We should be a spell? Yeah! Oh, curse. I like it. Is 
So now up and out. <laughs> okay. Carino. Nice. And then we get another Bataru. Oh, my ass cheeks are numb. If it's a fight you want, you got it. Kill the dog, kill the guard. I'd like to see Tolton getting faster here. Ooh, denied. There it is. I'm like sitting there going, I know there's money down here, damn it. We'll grab some more goodies. Random encounter is also starting. Random encounter rate is starting to increase, it would seem. Luckily, not by much. Okay, another one down. Never underestimate the royal house. Never underestimate a dude with a sword. Prepared to use it upon thy face. Let's keep moving. Don't go. Okay, up we go. Sweet. The cake there is a lie, so don't don't just do what you think you would normally do. Ignore that. There. Grab that. You can see why it wasn't worth taking the ladder because you would probably still see this, but you would have missed the other, the other, uh, the soul medicine. Just saying. It just makes it easier to not bother with it. Kitty! glory. I'm gonna have 
back. And up we go. And up we go again. Nice. Let's deal with such. Hey, I wasn't ready. We're not out of it yet. Tolton, who learns break hit, sweet. Keep moving. <coughs> so it's these are the seals we were talking about, or crests. We were in royal family crest. Could this be a royal seal? Royal seal in it. An ordeal that a king must can uh, endure to be crowned. The one who releases eight seals and obtains seven treasures shall challenge the Ring King's ordeal in his in his land. Royal tradition. I always thought it was legend, but now I have witnessed it with my own eyes. And we get the Royal Knight Sword and the Royal Knight Ring. Nice. Not that we're fighting enemies that require this, but every little bit helps because a plus 87 is pretty good and you'll notice that Seth cannot equip the the king these are known as king swords as you can see for Tolton only so this could be for anybody but for right now he could definitely use it all right let's head back to the ladder strong as see this is how Tolton gets caught up to a degree finding uh, these royal seals I'm not gonna lie it's the way to do it Head down. Some more goodies with some uh, more goodies. All right. Woo! -hoo! <laughs> Slowly but surely. Speaking of wardrobe changes earlier in the episode. What was that last episode? It might have been last episode. 
All right. Um. Hmm. As we grab, that's a full heal, and I believe this is a slot seed. Yeah. All right. Well. We've made it this far. And we're going to hit up this save point because saving is your friend. And I want to thank you guys for stopping by. I'm your host, the RPG Guy. When we come back, we've all we've got a lot more going on to deal with as far as, you know, betrayal and all these other issues that are happening. Poor Tolton. He was somebody's tool the entire time. But when we come back, we'll be dealing with that. Um... Check out my Twitch channel at twitch.tv slash jacktartstudios for more live gaming action that you don't want to miss out on. You can also support both the YouTube channel and the Twitch channel there on the Twitch channel currently. Um, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and we will see you guys next time.